A warehouse fire in Atala is still burning tonight, now in its 30th hour. I'm Jack Royer. And I'm Sherry Jackson. As that blaze rages on, firefighters from several agencies are working to get it under control. CBS 42's Malik Rankin joins us now live with the latest on the fire. Malik. Sherry, in the last update from the Atala Fire Major, he told us the fire here is 90% contained. Firefighters have been working tirelessly since noon yesterday with help coming in from over 10 counties. This 70,000 square foot warehouse was a storage facility for paper products. While the fire is mostly contained, the obstacle firefighters are facing now is the building itself. Because the majority of the fire is in the center of the building, and with the roof collapsing on top of the materials that's in there, it's too dangerous to send firefighters actually into the building to get to the fire. Nearby neighbors say the proximity of the flames have left them nervous. We're out here all the time watching it, just making sure it don't spread. Ashley Poss lives in an apartment next to the warehouse. She and others dropped off Gatorades for the first responders. Because it's hot and they had to, they've been away from their families the last few days, so the least I could do. That's not all she did. Monday night, her neighborhood got together to pray for the Atala Fire Department. They're brave, very appreciative. At least eight firefighters have been treated on site for heat exhaustion. Major Millam says no injury was severe enough to require hospitalization. Most of us have been actually working without any rest 20 plus hours. With the fire at 90% containment, they have been able to scale down their operations, allowing firefighters that came in from other counties to return home. The fire major says it will be several days before they're able to leave this site. And Malik, we know schools were closed today because of the problems with water pressure, so much of it being used in the fire. Have we learned if students will be back in class tomorrow? Yes, the neighbors I spoke with said they got an email from Atala City Schools saying that it will be business as usual for city schools tomorrow. Malik Rankin in Atala, where the fire is now over a day old. Malik, thank you.